Welcome everybody to the stream. I'm Noto. I am here with Frack, and today we are going to be casting Hello. Curl Cookies versus Choke Stralis, also known as Tempest. And yeah, this is going to be CBC Open. This is the quarterfinals. Whoever wins will go on to face the winner of Squid Fighters versus Colony in the semifinals. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so Pro Cookies, Choke Stralis. Choke Stralis probably the favorites. And so far, we will see Cash and Carrier are picked, Alleyway banned from Chokestralis, and Frack, what's your prediction here? 2-0 Tempest, easily. Yeah. And then last map is... I think it's like that. Yeah, I think that's OG. I think it's OG. Atomic, Atomic, Atomic. No, oh, Atomic. Over what's mad. You're a smart person, Frack. I wasn't here for the first two games. <laughs> yeah, I know, okay. Uh, all right so as sad as it is i can't showcase 1.4 in this stream um yeah thanks for banning our worst map <laughs> yeah so i definitely think the pick bands went in favor of chokestralis they obviously have always been quite on top of their band game and now find the funny how we're using hyperion skin because we got banned for fucking kill aura uh, <laughs> hey are they actually they're using Hyperion skin? Yeah, they're all using Hyperion skin. What if they got banned? That's actually it's really funny because he denied the ban at first, and he was like, "Yeah, it just it was just an error. My game crashed." <laughs> when he clearly said so, was memory from the game. Okay. Alright, so we will actually be getting into this Chokestraws on the CT side of Carrier. That means Pro Cookies on the T side. In this version of the meta, I'd say it's a T sided map, but. It is probably T sided. Yeah. But, I mean, it's gonna go CT way, <laughs> but it is T sided. Yeah, it is a T sided map. And so we will see uh, the Tempest standard ish B setup where they have one bridge. 2 lobby, 2B, but we will see PK going instantly for a short push. They will be taking some control. Nylee looking towards lobby, and Zappy already with a kill on C3 walls. So now, this is where Prokies can really get just totally owned, is if they just get stuck here. Because. Yeah, they're getting. But we will see one kill from Stupid. He takes down Ben. Smooth will instantly trade that. And Zephy nah. with another kill. Yeah, it looks like it's just gonna be Nightly and Kenny. They're both low. Zero and 19 or something. Yeah. Smooth with the kill and Zephy with the triple to end the round. Good try. Yeah, so really that round, the issue was that they got stuck. Like, also I hear your speakers, but. Uh, yeah, they didn't, they didn't push up. Yeah, they, they got stuck. They need to take out that lobby player or they need to take out that short player. Otherwise, you're just going to. Stall and not any progress. They're trying again, I guess. Yeah. All right. So it looks like it's gonna be a save, which is better than last last series. Yeah, we didn't get so They would force it. We will see Zephy playing that short position, instantly getting a headshot. It's kind of a thing. Oh, yeah. Sylvester, that guy who just killed. Oh, that's Sylvester. I mean, Lauren could catch Joey off right now. Joey checks it. And Joey with the kill. Too. So now. We will see the 3v4. One player did crash. Yeah, Ben crashed, dude. So, it's just gonna be a clean anti eco for Chokestralis. Zephy with a double, Joey with a double, Smooth with one. And really, Pro Cookies, they're just not really doing anything. They're just kind of sitting in a place and letting Tempest take pot shots at them, which is. We they been pushing up like B long, the short whatever you want to call it, and they're just sitting there. And they, they, they keep doing it. Yeah. They pre it, but no one's playing aggressive on Tempest side. They're just holding the angle. Was that nade? Didn't do. It. Oh, it did actually. Cool. Now you're off the 25. Yeah. Nice nade. Also, more importantly, gives info. We will see actually this time Sylvester pushing through, doing almost like they're listening to the casters. But no, uh, Sylvester with the double. He takes down Zappy. He takes down Smooth. And this is the first oh, real chance. We will see Joey getting taken down by Canary in mid, and Enchan now fighting them. Canary actually was taking down Enchan, and now it's Ben 
left in halls and Miley takes them down. So, with them getting those kills, smooth, I forgot to start the timer. I said a go, go, go. bet that you have to beat them in 50 minutes. I forgot to start the timer. I just like take off two minutes or whatever at the end. Yeah, three minutes, because like our round is about a minute each. So, now we will see. Let's let's see Progress trying to replicate the success. It's not a 14 0, which is. I know I was talking to Stupid earlier, and or actually Lightning, the owner, and he was hoping they wouldn't get 14 0, but at the same time, Zephyr in lobby getting a nice double kill. There will be one trade so from Canary. Getting, like, getting nice entries into lobby, but then they're, they're not checking out Zephyr. Now, should... All three players. Four Tempest are in lobby, and it looks like we will see a fallback from Pro Cookies. Stop ghosting. Oh, stupid! Stupid is ghosting. Yeah, oh. I'm not ghosting. Is uh, is our MG in the call? Yeah, MG is. Yeah, because MG is. Yeah. All right, so we will see Canary and Sylvester rotating through mid. Oh. And now, there is two players lobby, that's Inchan and Zafi. Now, there is also a player in bridge, that is Joey. He is half healthy, could get taken down by an M4 very quickly. However, we will see Canary peeking Zafi, does only one body shot, now Zafi is one hit. But at the same time, it's gonna be Sylvester in a 1v3, and Joey will take him down. Joey, not timing there, I guess. Just yeah, that was a timing kill. But I haven't taken any presses towards A. I have a feeling they can do this one round. No? Alright, yeah, let's just push pretty long again. Yeah, so they're gonna be pushing short and long again. That nade's gonna almost hit. Oh, I forgot to get it off. So, now. You will see what the big problem for Okugis is. They just sit and don't do anything. Like, yeah, not doing anything. And now Chokestralis get free shots on them. There will be Canary all the way over on the map. He is sniping, which is not the weapon I think I'd, I'd associate Canary with. In general, it's like good map. Yeah. And, yep. We got them Kills dried. We don't all the way for Truck Charles. 4 1 carry CT side. Not a very commonplace thing anymore until you know is a side. <laughs> okay, my family in the back, guys. But yeah, like A is a sight. Yeah. This time they're going in. They're going. Nope, nope, they're going through mid. He is B site. Yeah, they're pushing it along. They're gonna take some presence towards it. Joey Bridge Room gets the info who's back. We'll take a little bit of damage though. We'll molly it off, make sure they don't push him. But now we will see a trade frag in mid canary again take down Sylvester with the instant trade. Now Zephy push You go You got to see a uh, in channel again through CT. They got the first. And Joey actually pushing through generator, takes down Nile, he's on twenty one HP. And could do some damage. He will get taken down by stupid. And Bob should go down now. Inchan could double stop. But stupid will get killed. Now it's a three versus one for Zephy. He wins these, but this is quite an easy fight. It's, it's an easy All three fight. players are low. They have no idea where he is. They know where he is now. Yeah. He will get one. He will get a second. Last guy is like low. And Zephy pushing out onto the site. One versus one. Zephy whiffs. That was his one chance. And now Sylvester wins it. He won a clutch for Zephy. That's not a thing I say every day. Now Zephy going eleven to two. Um, yeah. So we see it being 4 2 for the side. Hyperion's asking for a link to the stream as if he doesn't know the very easy URL to remember. Anyway, we will see side swap. Yeah, what is it again? Twitch.tv slash competitive CBC. Oh wow, how oh, hot. You can even Google competitive CBC, it's the first thing that comes up. Like, it's like kind of dumb actually. 
Anyway, we will see Tempest running a B-split. Not Emily actually pushing through mid and somehow gets a kill. They will get traded, but Stupid now looking to trade back on that. We'll take down Joey in mid. Two on three now. Although, Zuffy will get a double. He's like completely not. He's getting knife by smooth. <laughs> that oh. steals his kill. So Zephy with a triple entry onto the site. 14 to 2. And now... Yeah. So Sylvester and Stupid trying their hardest, but it looks like the rest of the team not up to par right now. This, this was their map pick, by the way. They have two rounds on it, so it's not a 14-0, which I, a bunch of people were predicting. BK Proko's tier 3 team versus Jokestralis tier 1 team. Like, yeah. So now, Smooth in mid will get pushed by Sylvester. Gets actually headshot, but now Joey's coming to help along with Ben, who will get killed. So, now we will see Inchan push them through onto bridge, takes down Canary, Inchan with another onto Emily. Now it's 2 versus 5. Nylee and Stupid both will be in CT near A. Both. Uh, Stupid has an SMG, but he's getting flanked by Joey. And now it's Nylee, who is just gonna get free fired by Joey. Inchan steals his kill, though. <laughs> Inchan with the 3k eco frags to make him have a positive KD again. Nice job, Inchan. We're just supposed to do it. 3k eco frags. <laughs> yeah. Inchan need, said he needs to go positive. But now we will see. The last round, this is a match point for Chokestralis. Pro Cookies are going to be on the CT side and they need to win this out if they want any hope of winning this map and more likely any hope of winning this series. So, now we will see actually Canary taking down Smooth for short. There will be Sylvester fighting Ben, but Sylvester has to run through Omali. He's gonna whiff onto Ben, and Ben actually gets the kill in the end, even though it looked like Sylvester was winning that fight. It's now it's a nice 1 verse 4 for Canary. They already have one kill, they have to ace to win it. They get Joey towards Bridge. They get Inchan towards Lobby. It's a 2 on 1, they have to ace Klexus. Frack, Frack, you think they're gonna get this? No, all oil. Um, no, he won't. They've got the angle set up. You got Zephy holding uh, CT, and you got Ben holding Lobby. Zephy grinds to Zephy's angle. Zephy actually whiffs Zephy. But nah, Zephy yeah. gets the kill anyways. NT. GG. Detroit, yeah. Now that was an NT. So. That map was 10 minutes. Now we will see Cash, which was Chokeshaw's map pick. And. Cash. I have not seen Corkies actually ever play Cash because it, it's always been a map that they just despise. But now I'm thinking I don't think they have really have much of a chance on cash. It seems like the one map they don't really have a chance on. No, I don't think they have it. Yeah, like cash is the map I like would say is Profi's probably their worst map. If I had to say a single, if I had to give a single choice. Oh no, Progate is gonna be stalling. Uh, waiting a minute. Stalling. Stalling. But now we will see Zephyr with a 15 to do. Did you export sets? No, it's. Uh, I'll give Oh, the that's because um, Discord it. uses markdown formatting, which means yeah, yeah, that if yeah. you have like an underscore, um, it starts uh, underlining it, unless you uh, have another underscore later that stops the underline. So players who have lots of underline names get underlining. Yeah, it starts from the end of Zephy's name to the start of Zephy's. <laughs> yeah, where the two underscores break it off. Yeah. yeah. Na Navi just lost 16-2 to Mary Sports. Oh. 
Okay, ready, goes through. It's gonna be the last map probably in this series. Chuck Strauss looking to go through to fight Colony. You don't in the two. You don't think they can pick up the next two maps? Being that they never play cash and never play okay, Atomic. So we're doing this in the Dutch oven, right? Gotta have some faith in there, too. I have to have faith, but... What's easier? PK, the team is full team or GFN. The, the other big pot from the set, though. Yeah, so... I think the Dutch oven has enough room for all of this, doesn't it? Like, this is the Dutch oven. It's cash. Alright. <coughs> we are going to do... <coughs> video games. It's going to be starting. No servers. Yeah, I, I haven't seen that glitch in forever. It's like that glitch stopped happening. Hey, uh, no servers. For cash. Um, shout out to oh. Ha! Oh. It actually goes. Uh, someone's not in. Actually, no, they're all in. Okay. So now we will be going. Chuck Strawless going to be going to be Proteus yeah, 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 yeah. going A. Yeah, it is. I, I think. I don't care. I'm gonna do eight cups of Shout out to Shout out to Clominator. Okay. So now. Twenty seconds until this game starts. And yeah, Cash is the map that I basically is without a doubt. Proctor's worst map. No one out of their team plays this map at all, other than possibly Canary. I mean, I don't think the fact that it's cash matters too much. I think it's just the fact that they're a good tempest. Yeah, that too, but even if... Yeah, Colony, now I'm getting Colony spamming my PMs by top. By top. So, now we will see... Chokes, I'll see the side, probably the preferred side of cash. Procure's on the T side. I prefer T side to be honest. I feel like it's easy to pick up four, five rounds. Yeah, honest, I prefer CT because it's like kind of easy. But in chat with the pre nade a boost, if that nade hit, he would have actually got the triple kill, but he four. missed it. So now we will see an A take from Hulk. Procure's, they're gonna be showing right away. Three squeaky. Three squeaky. They've been walking into a stack. You've got three players on site and one rotating. Yeah, so super fast rotates from Tempest. And yeah, now we're seeing the problem with Pearl Cookies and why they're not a tier two team as opposed to a tier three team. They just don't go anywhere. Like, it's honestly their one huge flaw. They're just sitting everywhere where they go. They finally decided to rotate, but it's a tad late now, I guess. They've lost a the player. So, now there will be Joey flanking Squeaky. They did Squeaky, yeah. <laughs> Joey pushing through. Okay, he should have gone pick there, and luckily he did, otherwise I probably would have pulled my hair out there. But now, Zephy peeking from a main. This is a free kill, come on! PK! It's just not nice to watch, is it? It's not nice to watch, no one isn't. The bomb is stuck on boost. Zephy well. was a free kill right there. Just, just gonna try to save armor, probably. It's the last player alive. 9 HP. Emily. Towards the side room. And now, just gonna be saving 19 seconds, which is not helping Smooth win the bet, Brucey, by the way. Oh, no. It's all going in the pink. Oh, just have a timer back up. Oh. They're lucky. Okay, alright, they've, they've been given an extra, like, couple minutes. Yeah, they've been given an extra two minutes at this point. Considering that was a two minute long round. So, pro cookies, looking towards two minutes have passed, yeah. That was a two minute round. So now, Inshan keeps on missing that boost nade. It's a B rush for Pro Cookies. Yeah, we've done aggressive big main. Walking is like a full man stack. He gets one, he gets two, he gets three. He gets three. Are we gonna see an eco ace? <laughs> Actually, no. Oh, yes. I, I cast her cursed it. They tried coming into B and Joey said nope. <laughs>
All right, so it's going to be round three, and now Procre is looking just to get anything, right? Really, um, part of it is a bet between JFN and Tempest on who can win more rounds, but we see Sylvester actually instantly picking Inchan who threw that nade, but we still see Joey Vance gonna do damage. Yeah, we only got one B, but there is one more in heaven. Yeah, go and CT now, actually. So now? It depends what they want. They got the two-man advantage now, we can basically choose whoever they want. They may pick off Joey, they should definitely go B, and he, Joey should get picked off right now. We will see Ben towards CT. Ben, Joey should be dead, but he's finally gonna die to command. Yep. Ben is CT rotating towards Trium, it looks like. He's cut those. Ben could catch him off, maybe get one or two going ramp. Yeah, he will. He, one. he will get one. Uh, he will get peaked by Emily, but Emily actually playing the smart gets Ben down to six HP. But now we will see Ze Zephy actually pushing from Vets on twelve oh, HP. Both players are low though. This is winnable. Oh, it doesn't matter if you hit your shots. And that did they just choke a four v two versus players? Why is Emily peaking them CT? Okay. Should have hit them. The ben and Zephy were both ten HP. And they won a 2v4. I don't know what Emily was doing then, but she should have stayed under heaven and like not shot a bullet or anything. Stayed on her and peaked at the end and got maybe an easy double. Yeah. So, Chokestralis winning that round somehow. Um, Inchan sniping boost. Sylvester like to get that pick, but Inchan, he's the best one to let that happen. And now we will see, looks like a setup for an A take. We will see Sylvester spamming boost but rotating. But we will see Zephy and Smooth uh, shutting down people at Squeaky. Don't ask why two people peak Squeaky. So, now we will see. Joey's flanking A main. Yeah. Joey flanking A main. Actually gets predicted oh. by Sylvester, so. Now it's a 3v4. Squeaky is amazing, says Phoenix. Sylvester, very low, on 25 HP. Ben's gonna win that duel in mid. Stoop. Stoop Andrew's on the side though. They've got one cord, one from the highway, one flank. This is winnable if they play it right. I doubt they will work. And that is actually oh. a, a really, really good timing good from Canary. Down, now it's a one versus one, stupid versus ben. ben. Both are one hit, potentially. Both are potentially ben one hit. Angle. He's got angle and bomb. Stupid on 2 HP, it. Ben on 45. He should, he should climb cap, he should climb cap. Yeah, prevent that headshot, on. because the thing is, Ben is headshotable by an M4, it's not an angle, you don't want to take these low ground angles where you can get headshot, but at the same time, Ben just wins it. Does not matter. I was close round. Close round. I was all played by both teams. Yeah. But- Oh, smooth time is gone, GG bro. So, timer's out. PK win. So now, Inchan is gonna be actually taking out Stupid instantly at boost. Inchan should be falling back now. Over peaking angles that they shouldn't be. Yeah. Definitely when they're not winning them. Or not if they're doing damage back. Tempest. Because Inchan, Inchan gets the kill, doesn't get tagged once. Yeah, so now, 4, verse 5, and we will also see Joey pushing through B main from the looks of things, going for that flank, or actually that's Ben, not Joey, Ben going for that flank, he's gonna catch out Sylvester, gets the headshot Sylvester did not buy head armor, but we will see Emily trading, but at the same time, Ben now knows they're basically all towards the A side of the map. I mean, they've still got 2A, 2B. Yeah. I think they should try pushing middle, but uh, Zephy just kind of screwed it over them. So. Yeah, so Zephy getting the pick, and oh, now he's moving towards Zephy. Shroud. Zephy just playing on angle. I don't think they're gonna check at Shroud. I mean, I don't think they're even gonna push A. We will see Emily though pushing through mid, takes down Inchan. Nice kill, but now Inchan knows that they're going towards the B side of the map. We actually will see the. F they should rotate back. They should rotate back here right now. Especially considering. Zephy, especially considering Joey just got that kill. 
Nylee and Z Joey both stuck on an awkward reload. But Nylee actually gets the- Emily will get the kill. Why am I saying Nylee? Wolf click on one. Wolf on one. Nice try. Emily with 4k, almost the ace. I probably would have screamed if that happened. A smooth like low reach Thank you as well. So now, that was a good flick, yeah, it was. If they turned around like half a second sooner, that would have actually been an ace clutch. But, Inshan, just getting that info and made at the start of the round. And now it's a full on B take, fast B take from Progress. It's almost like they're listening to us, but they have to do something. But Ben is gonna get caught out at ramp, but it... No, he's not. Jerry's gonna come in and save him there. Sylvester also with. Ben's not been that low to be honest, he's 48. Yeah, but they had f like three seconds of free shots and they whiffed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He should have had him. <laughs> but we will see that Joey now playing from tree. And along with Zephy flanking events, this round is going to be over. It's going to be a 6 0 CT half for Chokes Giles. They have to win one more round to 7 0 on the round pick of cash. So now. Not fun to watch. Pro cookies. Especially when Ben's not bragging. Up against the ropes. Pro Cookies have to, they have to win this round if they want to stay in this tournament. So and I don't think they can do it, but I'm still up for seeing anything. Choke Strauss looking to go on to face Colony in the semi-finals. All they have to do is win this one round. They will be going for a two mid take with three going towards A main. Looks like it's going to be an A split, there is a three man stack towards A for Pro Cookies. But at the same time, the Molly flies out. Joey, that's a great Molly. It's gonna force Nylee into an awkward position. There will be the knife kill. Ben, ben oh. And Joey and Zachary will get the kills. It's Emily and Canary left. Two on four, they have to win this. It happened in the um, last game that Zephy then played. Ben was top fragging, and then Zephy just overtook him towards the end. So now, Canary. Looking towards that catwalk, they're the last player alive. They are in a one versus four, and in it will be Zephy to take them down rather fittingly. Zephy going to 13 to 2, and that will be the game, that will be the series, and that will be the end of the line for Pro Cookies. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and that will be the series. I hope you tune in in a couple in about 20 minutes to, I'm not sure who is streaming, there's, there's a game in 20 minutes, I can't remember, Play. It, that is Colony Squid Fighters, I'm not sure who's streaming it, it's not me because I have something else, thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and until next time, tune in, peace.